Hey everyone, today I'm taking a closer look at my GE sensor microwave. I absolutely love this thing. I bought all the GE appliances, as you can see. Uh, this is the overrange microwave. I just wanted to give you a closer look. Really nice control panel, as you can see here. Great design, stainless steel. Um, fits good in the in the cabinet, not flush. It does stick out a little bit. Um, it's gonna vary depending on you know your kitchen. Um, with mine, this is how it stuck out. Um, but good, good height on your um, stove here. It meets all the code and everything. And you open it up, you have um, a nice big space here with your spinner. So pretty standard, but this thing works great. Uh, it's got some really nice features as you can see. It's got the melt feature, uh, reheat, defrost. You can of course hit potato, beverage, popcorn. Um, popcorn and melt is probably the one we use most often and reheat like around you know lunch or leftovers. You have your express cooks here. And then there's some other microwave features down here. Um, so very nice one. Um, I absolutely love this thing. It does have a light underneath, as you can see right there. It's got a couple different modes. And then it does have a vent fan as well. And it will say like fan, vent fan high. And then it has low. So vent fan low and off. I'll go ahead and be quiet real quick and give you an idea of how loud it is. So very quiet. Not disruptive at all. Very pleasant, very quiet. That's on the high setting. On low, it's barely, barely audible. Go ahead and turn that off. And I love this surface light. A lot of times I leave this on at night when the kitchen lights are off just because it gives you some under cabinet lighting. Um, so all around, this is just a really premium um, product. Matches my premium GE um, stove and range, of course. So I had to go with it top of the line.